welcome. If I can just grab your attention for a few minutes. Uh, my name is Chris Cooney. I'm president of the Metro South Chamber of Commerce. And I'm just delighted to be here uh, on the lawn of the Ames Estate uh, in this beautiful historic building on this wonderful campus of Stonehill College. Uh, we're delighted to be here. And uh, let's just first off have a round of applause for our host, Stonehill College. Fran Dillon is here. And while we're doing that, I also want to thank Sedexo for their wonderful service and the food that they're providing here tonight, uh, as well as Rich Morgan from Rich Morgan Photography, who's taking your picture. If you haven't met Rich, uh, introduce yourself to him. He does a lot of our photos, and we always tell him, try to get some people we haven't seen in a while or folks uh, that aren't usually in the photos. So uh, Rich is right here. Raise your hand, Rich. And uh, just raise your hand if we haven't gotten your photo, and we'd love to do so. Thank you. So I uh, want to also have a shout-out for our jazz. Uh, is it a quartet? Yes. Uh, the Nicoli brothers. I'm not sure the official name. It's Alley Quartet, I believe. And uh, they are just fantastic, uh, so thank you guys for being out today. Um, we have some great door prizes tonight, so if you haven't put your card into uh, the basket here, make sure you do. Uh, Aaron Lawrence has the basket, and uh, you'll be eligible for some, some prizes. Uh, I do want to ask, uh, at this point, you to join in welcoming our sponsor for tonight. This is the fourth year Crescent Credit Union. Uh, has uh, located a, a, a spot like this. We've had uh, wonderful weather at four different uh, historic, I, I'll call them homes or mansions, in the region. Uh, we were at the Bradley Estate last year, which was wonderful, and I've uh, been in, uh, in Easton earlier than that. But uh, this, not, this event could not happen and did not happen until Crescent Credit Union stepped forward. Uh, under the leadership of um, Bob Gustafson, who's the president, longtime president of Crescent Credit Union, and Jonah Ween, who is his uh, director of marketing and uh, everything else. Uh, so please join me in welcoming uh, Bob Gustafson. Bob. He's deferring his time to you. Oh, he's deferring, okay. <laughs> he said, if you want to say some nice things about him, here. Well, yeah. Fran is such a gentleman, I wanted to see how he gave the speech because I can learn from him. But anyways, all right, so he's next. So on behalf of Crescent Credit Union, I want to welcome everybody here. And as Chris said, this is the fourth year we've done that. And of course, we plan on good weather. You know that, yeah, right. all right? That's why he keeps inviting us back. And uh, so thank you, Lord, for the good weather. And uh, I think the first year we started in downtown Easton at the Children's Museum, you may remember that. And then Ames Free Library the next year. And then you said the Bradley Estate last year. And here we are at uh, wonderful Stonehill College. So it's, it's great to be here. Uh, fantastic view. We look down here, there's construction going on. And on the left, is that the Leo J. Meehan building that's being, con uh, business, business school being constructed? And then to the right, I think, was the Welcome Center. Dylan Hall. Dylan Hall. <laughs> Dylan Hall. Oh, okay, great. Dylan Hall. You <laughs> certainly deserve it. Friend. That's going to cost you, friends. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a great spot to be. If you've got to be somewhere this evening, I think this is the best place to be. And so I hope you all agree. Um, excuse me. <clears throat> I think we do agree. Thank you. Thank you. We have a couple board members here tonight. Fred Nicoli's here. Fred, raise your hand. Okay, Fred's over here. And Dr. Paul Marino and uh, John Kalenzis, uh, board members. Did I miss anybody? I hope not. I'll have to pay for that if I did, right? Okay, did I miss anybody? I hope not. And we have um, five or six staff members here, if you'd raise your hand. So, okay, these are our staff members, okay? And make sure, you, staff members, you meet all our guests this evening, okay? That's your job this evening, okay? All right. Um, some of you um, have heard uh, that Fran may be retiring. I know that's a rumor. For, is that? December 31st, Okay. okay. <laughs> After 44 years overseeing development, alumni communication, media relations, other initiatives, sitting on committees with me. That was difficult, I'm sure, over the years and so forth. And uh, on the board of uh, Good Samaritan Hospital, going back to the Goddard Hospital, on the board together. So uh, Fran has, has been 
uh, a real stalwart in the, in the community, and he's retiring shortly, and I'd just like to give him a hand and thank him for all you've done for our community. In, and we'd just like to thank you all for attending, and we know it's a little warm, but you know, the more you drink, the, the less you notice it, so <laughs> please feel free. I do want to thank uh, Mike Nicoli and the Alley Quartet for entertainment this evening who are up here. They're here. I want to thank you very much, Michael and your group. I also want to thank Frank Al Altieri and Will Hope from Shoveltown Brewery. Blackberry Brewery. And Cheryl Savage, you told me you enjoyed that Blackberry Brewery very much, so okay. <laughs> Cheryl thanks you also. And thank you, Stonehill College and Sodexo for uh, putting on uh, this evening. And those of you who heard me before, you know that I'm a man of a few words, so I've said a few words, so that's it. Thank you again. Thank you. Uh -oh. Thanks, Bob. Appreciate it. Thank you for your whole team at Crescent Credit Union for helping us put this together in such a big way. So we're here for the next hour or so. Uh, enjoy uh, the music and food and fellowship and networking and some fun. And uh, in the meantime, I just want to remind you that the Chamber has many programs that are coming up in this fall. Uh, you may have had a chance to meet some of our new staff, uh, Aaron Lawrence and... and uh, Emma is here, and we have two uh, interns with us tonight, and there's a couple of other folks back uh, at the ranch that you'll be uh, meeting at the events coming up in this fall. But we talk this, year, this time of year about our season ticket, and uh, season ticket, you can save over $100 if you register, pre-register for all the events coming up. We have a number of uh, six or seven events uh, already scheduled through uh, spring of next year. So if you have any questions on that, please see Erin, and she can uh, help you register for that. Our next event is at Barrett's Ale House, um, September 19th, and uh, we will feature the district attorney, Tim Cruz, along with uh, Dr. Michael Krasantnik. He's the executive director for the Center for International Studies and Engagement at Bridgewater. He just released a book, a new book, on um, demographics and how that's going to uh, shape our world going forward. And uh, so that should be interesting and what we should be looking at as business people and as uh, Americans uh, going forward in terms of changes that are being expected. Um, let's see. Beyond that, we do have uh, economist Dr. Mike Goodman coming in October uh, to give an uh, economics overview of what's going on in the state and in the country. Uh, he's a repeat speaker. He comes every other year, uh, and he'll be here in October. And then we have uh, someone from the Fenway Red Sox management staff also coming. Uh, in October or December. We're still finalizing that. So we've got some great programs, and we hope to see you at one of those. I do want to mention uh, Senator Mike Brady, who just joined us. Uh, Mike, uh, and the select person, chairperson of the, the town of Easton, Dottie Falconetti. Uh, Dottie. And we have uh, City Councilor uh, Ann Beauregard, and Chair of the Regional School District, uh, Mark Lindy, and the School Superintendent, Kathy Smith. Okay, so thank you very much. Um, anybody I didn't announce that what I was supposed to? Okay, good. So uh, being no other, please enjoy. I think the music's going to start in a few minutes. Uh, beer this way, wine that way, food, and sliders under the tent over here. Thank you very much. Hope to see you soon at another event.
Thank mm-hmm. you. 